a tale of two Stuart S50 steam engines. This one is part eight. The short series is now more or less complete. In this episode, I show both of the engines running on the bench using compressed air, individually and then together. The S50 on screen is part of my own collection. The other one will be fitted into a high quality model steam plant and featured in the series Building a Model Steam Plant. Both of these S50 steam engines are quite different. This one is a factory machine kit. Even the bed plate castings are different. This one has a bigger flywheel, a cast iron cylinder and a larger diameter crankshaft. This engine had been used to drive a generator and when I bought it, it was worn out. A Stuart S50 has the bearing blocks cast into the bed plate and these have always been okay. They wear quite well but this one had done a lot of running and in my opinion the original design of the bearings needs an upgrade to carry such a heavy flywheel. If you've been following the series you will realise that I modified the bearings and the modification was quick and successful. When I was doing the job I thought to myself I bet somebody writes in and says why don't you remove the old bearings and make proper bearings. And I was right, one person wrote in and said exactly that. My answer to this person is quite simple. I have better things to do with my time than spend a lot of it making bearings for an S50 when the entire bed plate is only £29 plus VAT from Stuart Models. But fettling the casting and drilling the holes in the right place would still take time, so I really think that my solution is the quickest and it works. You'll be pleased to know that I'm not going to speak all the way through this video, in fact I've nearly finished speaking now. I will be running the engines fast, just to make sure nothing falls off them. When running the engine at a high speed it's a good idea to hold something over the exhaust. For two reasons, one is it stops the oil from going everywhere and it also prevents me from breathing it in. The running in process or breaking in process of this engine is not fully complete so it's slightly tight in places. These engines run very quietly when they're running slowly so you can actually hear me breathing and I'm really sorry about this, I did try stopping breathing but then I slumped forward on the bench and everything went black, so please forgive me for breathing. And while I walk into the light, it's time I think for a bit of slow motion. That is it from me in this video. Stay safe, stay healthy, thanks for watching, and I hope you find it useful.
please take the time to visit my Mainsteam Models website and click on the section of the website that says Video Playlists. And by doing that you can find other videos that you may like to watch. And by using the playlists you can actually watch the videos back to back.